Hey, what's up? This is Danny Spire from BeingQG.com. We are in Surf City, USA. That's right, Huntington Beach, the 2010 U.S. Open of Surfing. Go check out the action. Well, this is a different type of a contest, right? It's in a stadium atmosphere, and then you bring the best surfers in the world here with, some, I don't know, 500,000 people, and something good's gonna happen. Especially for the younger guys moving up, this is a big contest. This is their stage. One of the best parts about the U.S. Open is that the action is non-stop during the day and at night. A lot of things happening here every single day. Too much for any, any one person to get to any of them. US Open is the funnest. Everyone comes here that surfs. Everyone knows each other and it's just, it's a good time. Although the US Open features plenty of nightlife, the week is still all about surfing. nothing else like Huntington for sure. It's five times the size of any of the events we go to uh, in terms of the kind of crowd and it's cool to come here and kind of take it all in and you know use it to kind of lift your performance. City on the beach, it's such a big showdown here, so uh, you know, lots of action, it's always good to come down and check it out. So the saying goes, once is fun, twice is nice. Here, here with a two-time U.S. Open champion, Brett. Brett, how do you feel, man? I think this year is almost, in a way, almost a little bit more rewarding than last year. I mean, last year was so, like, my kind of breakthrough year, but just, I've never had to, to defend a title. Cheers. Thanks, Brett. Thanks, guys. This wraps up the 2010 U.S. Open surfing. Thanks to Hurley, Nike 6.0, and Converse for putting on a great event, and congratulations to Brett Simpson for winning.